Mike, what you up to today? Today we're going to start our peppers and tomato plants. So uh, once again, thanks for coming to the channel. Let's check out the different steps that I take with starting my peppers and tomatoes. So come along with me and enjoy the video. Well, let's begin. Here's my seed starting mix. And I'll be pouring this into a bucket. And then we'll go ahead and add some water. We want to get the soil nice and moist. And then of course after that we're going to hand mix it. Then I have my seed start trays here where I'm going to go ahead and add the soil. Just toss whatever you need in there and then you're going to gently pack it in. Not real tight but and here it is finished. Now that we have our trays prepared, here are the different pepper seeds that I'll be starting today. This is what I'll be growing in the garden. And now we're going to go and look at the uh, tomato seeds that I'll be starting this year. All of them I have planted before except for the last one. It's a new variety. So I'm looking forward to seeing how that turns out. Now we'll prepare our labels for our seeds that we're starting. Here I've went ahead and started planting the Mountain Glory. I'm only planting two Mountain Glories this year. And in front, I've started planting some Tachi tomato plants. That's Aroma. When I did, I just used my fingertip, made a little divot, add one seed, but the Mountain Glories I did add two. Since I'm only starting two, I want to make sure I get those uh, tomato plants. And then I went ahead and labeled the Tachi. You want to make sure you always label your stuff when you get done placing the seed so you don't forget what you've planted. And then get some uh, seed starch soil. Place over the top. And you just want to gently just tamp those seeds in. You just want good soil seed contact. And there they are, complete. There's the rest of the tomatoes that I've planted. And then again, here we are with the peppers. All the peppers have been started. Here's a view of the completed project with the lid. Now we're prepared to put this on the seed start mix or the seed start mats. Here's the area I have prepared. And now we'll go ahead and add our trays, lights, heat. Hopefully in a few days we'll have good germination. Thanks a lot for watching. And we'll see you next time.